And uh, welcome back to more Let's Play Blood Rain. I'm hopefully going to finish the game in this sitting. I really think I'm going to try for that. So, there were landmines. Of course, there can't be landmines up here. So, we have to stay off the ground. Which is easy enough. However, there are these guys. And Panzer Shreks. Oh, these are like the elite guys. I just want to... There we go. Alright. So the game has been a right bitch to me today. Seriously, all the stuff it's been pulling on me. But, I will endure. Right. Alright. There will be no landmines here. I shot that guy's arm off. I can just get on this guy. But I used to have a torso. In fact, I seriously do think... Right, I'll take the Panzer Shrek now. I've had that grenade launcher for a long time. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we are getting to serious endgame stuff here, in fact. So, maybe the whole completing the game thing won't be difficult. I forgot that I had to... Uh, right, let's... Good thing I grabbed this Panzer Shrek. Armor Stinger, take out that hard suit. Please hit him. Please hit him. Did that go like that go way over him? Oh man. Alex seriously needs to hit him with that. What is this interference? Are you dead? No, you're not dead. Awesome way to shoot a Panzer Shrek. He's still alive. Throw a grenade. Uh, in it, I knew that was gonna happen. That's like Left 4 Dead tank stuff right there. Oh, I'm not on that. It's like that's always how it works. Like in Left 4 Dead, when you die from a tank and then you're shooting him with your pistols in like the at the end of it or something, or he's on fire and he always ends up dying just afterwards. Well, at least there's not too much to go for. If I could just shoot him with the Panzer Shrek a couple times, maybe go back and grab the other Panzer Shrek as well. I can, I can kill him. Let's just quickly get back to there. So let's just do not shoot the Panzer Shreks. Please don't. Oh man! Oh man! Get on him. I know. Maybe I should like. There we go. It's on the three. I wonder if I can get just run past this guy. I'm gonna try that. Or is he? No, he's not in it. Yeah, let's just run for it. Oh gosh. Hello, Jürgen. Jürgen. What the fuck? Alright. Ow. Run the frick away. <laughs> Why didn't Wolf kill me when he had the chance? Who knows? Let's just run from the explosion. Don't stand still. Oh, look at that! Fucking jump! Fucking jump! Oh gosh! Just get off the bridge. All right, all right. Oh, baby! I freaking score a crit there, or what? Throw the grenade somewhere else. That guy's freaking out. Let's see. Against these guys, I really don't want to feed on one of them whilst the others are still airborne. Because they will tear me apart. I can just bring one down, though. Oh my good lord. Just fucking die. Get down here. What? 
Oh man. Where is he? Can I just go through here? Alright, I'm good. Oh man. Jeez. Oh, it's these guys! Because I'm pretty sure these are the last this is the last boss fight before the the end. Like before the final boss fight. Glad I got someone to feed on. And you as well. I can't quite remember how these guys work. I think just kill them, really. Just just slice them up. That's pretty much how it works, I think. Oh, the doppelganger twins. What a pleasant surprise. Such handsome Nazis. And two of them. We had no idea the troublemaker would be as beautiful as you are. And gentlemanly, my luck is turning. What is your name, Fräulein? Why bother with names? This won't be more than a one-night stand. Ah, that is too bad. A shame, really. We were hoping for something more of a commitment. You know, you two remind me of someone. Someone you're fond of? Wouldn't go that far. Just someone I killed. Again and again. <laughs> she speaks of Hedrox. So, you boys lose your arms playing the catch? No, we were born conjoined. But sadly, separated soon after birth. Well, when I'm done, you'll both be missing more than an arm. We don't miss an arm. We miss the connection we once had. You boys are too much. Now this might a little. Yeah. Right, so it's kind of strange. You should stop this nonsense. And join us. Are you talking about what I think you're talking about? Isn't she wonderful, brother? My thoughts exist. Wonderful. <laughs> Right, I definitely can't feed on these guys. So let's just. She's spicy. I'm limber. Meow. You know what? Let's just. Oh, I don't even have my freaking door. Oh. Oh, I just love the crinkle above her nose when she gets angry. Wonderful move, little girl. What the fuck? Oh, look, we surprised her brother. What a becoming look on her face. Oh, tell her, Sigmund, she should know. As with everything else, we share each other's pain. One of us is unaffected, while the other suffers. So, you punch yourself when you're mad at your brother? <laughs> She's so quick. We should keep her. We really hate to have to hurt you, pretty girl. So that's a serious connection they have. I don't know why this guy just will not, like, really do anything to me. Ah, oh, here we go. <sighs> Fuck it, let's just go. Give in to us. Alright, let's focus on this guy. The one without the cape. There we go. Sigmund! I will not fight you anymore. My brother has been mortally wounded. I will follow soon. She's better than us, brother. She is pretty, is she not? She is. She never told me. My brother would like to know your name. It's Ray. Pretty. Sigmund, my brother. So. 
quite a tragedy, really. Who could that be? <laughs> Brilliant. Still make the sounds. Are you really dead or are you just playing? Never mind. What? Hello, Ray. You know, your whole coming back from the dead act is really starting to get old, Mince. Rain, I'm a double agent ever since that mission in Louisiana. You expect me to swallow that? Yes, I do. Who do you think saved you after Wolf left you for dead in Louisiana? Who do you think led you to the target file in Germany? Who do you think has been your informant this entire time? I... would... Here. Officer Moonfakes. You can check them off your list. Maybe now you believe me. So why haven't you killed a wolf yet? It's not that easy. He's almost invincible with all the relics in his body. But we can't let him get Belier's heart. It's the most dangerous piece. Hadrox already has it. What? I don't think he knows how to use it, though. He's looking for officers to interrogate. I thought the relic was automatic. I did, too. But nothing happened. We need to get that thing away from him and Wolf. The heart can awaken the demon himself, and we can't let that happen. Mints. We are actually now very total real end game now. <gasps> Mints. <laughs> <laughs> you bastard! I shouldn't be doing that. I'm gonna make you pay for this. You hear me? You'll pay for this. Yes, it's a rich burberry. Feed it. Go to hell. Why do you think I haven't killed you yet? That's gonna be your biggest mistake, you son of a bitch. Headlocks waits in the cathedral. You will join us. You both have something I want. I'll kill you, Wolf. Do you hear me? I'll pull you to pieces. Grr. Oh. I'm guessing I can't do that when Wolf is there. Hello. Mince. Oh, jeez. Mince. You aren't coming back this time, are you? Oh, I can pay. I promise. Today, Jürgen Wolf will die. Yep, she ain't coming back from that one. Right. We're now going on to the final part of the game. This is a uh, actual, like, final boss. Of wolves and demons. Let's just uh, nom you. Up. Still a fair bit of is it the zombies? I'm not full of zombies in freaking ages. What the hell? Uh, these are Nazis. Maybe they sound slightly similar. Alright, let's just. I want to be full health for when I go into uh, the final part of the game. Let's just dismember you, please. Get dismembered, please. This guy's pretty iconic, because that's the last Nazi I will ever kill. I've killed a lot of them. Yes, I'm pretty sure. Well, I suppose Wolf is a Nazi, but last, like, normal Nazi. Give me the heart, Edrox. Yes. 
You're gonna have to come and get it. Oh. So that's Bolaya. Now, this is uh, the the thing with Bol this uh, this last fight is that Bolaya and Wolf both need to be killed at the same time. The thing about Bolaya, let's see, get out of that one, is that um, Bolaya has to be killed via shooting at the heart, which is, this is probably the only time uh, extrude vision actually comes in handy. Oh, Panzer Shrek is hard. But you have to do it quickly, or as fast as you can, because Belia will keep getting bigger and bigger until eventually he just destroys this whole place. So there is a time limit here. Son of a bitch. Please tell me there are Nazis around here, actually, because I'm going to need the health and the ammo. I hope there are Nazis in here. Otherwise, uh, fighting Wolf is going to be a right bitch. Alright, there are guns. But I do not know about health. Right, let's get back down. Where is it? Oh, there you are. Alright, is that back up there or is it here? The only time this will ever come in handy. His heart dead in the center. Oh, I hit Wolf once. I wish that killed him. Save them for wolf. Oh, that did hit him. Now, if you give him enough time, oh shit, Belia will become like ridiculously big. Like he will get massive. He's not that difficult because he doesn't seem to have any ranged attacks. It's just, oh god, I don't know if I can hit him when he's like that. I just want to fight Belia first, because otherwise he will, he will like give me a game over if he gets big enough. Oh, I think he does have. So when the hell did you pick up a freaking Panzer Shrek, man? Oh, don't, 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 please don't. See, one other thing is that uh, probably noticed in the other video through an annotation that I should have put in. I'm bad at remembering twin annotations. That uh, I can't actually record like cinematic cutscenes. I don't know why, but this, I, I can't record cinematics. So I'm probably going to have to link the cinematics unless I can find a way to record them, which would, I'd really like to. But uh, I'd like to. Uh, I'd like to do that, but I'm not sure if I can. So. I'm pretty sure there are two cinematics for the end game, but it's just a bit annoying that I have to do this. If I die again, then I may just try and take Belia down to pretty much dead. 
and then uh, start recording again. Well, let's just try and do something good here. Am I sure that me? I can find more Panzer Shreks. Oh. Oh, that's, I bet that was mine. And, uh, can I? No. Ow. Man. I don't know how I'm going to get my health back here. I don't even know if I can. In fact, I'm pretty sure I can't. Mm. Just trying to grab these guns. Pretty sure there's a Panzer Shrek up here. Or at least a Panzer Fust. Or something. Something explosive. Ah, here we go. Where are you, Goliath? There you are. Ah, <laughs> just dropped down on him. See, if Wolf would just run off by himself, that would be lovely. Stop moving. Come on. Yeah, I know. That was a brilliant shot. I hope that's actually hitting it. Oh my gosh. What was that? I saw a Panzer Shrek. Area of effect. That one didn't even hit him. Oh, come on. No. She does a lot of target onto it. But see, it's a bit more difficult to hit it. This really sucks. They give you all the Nazis just to make sure you're at full health. Oh, god damn. Everything hurts so bad. I know. But I think I ain't gonna survive this. No, the Panzer Fuss, though. Giggle some more, because if I take one tiny bullet, I'm dead. And I ain't fighting Wolf with that low health. God damn. Is there really no way for me to replenish my health? Start to see the skull on Belia, at least. They have to be pretty precise, actually. What? I just died from nothing there. Oh, man. Right, I'm gonna have to... Right, I'll try and take him down to pretty much dead. In fact, I'm gonna try out trying to beat Wolf first. Oh, come on. Yeah, that was a brilliant freaking missile, wasn't it? What the hell is with that thing? Do stop running around, please. Just get that. Just, if I can, just tear the fuck out of him. Because I think it'd be a lot easier to fight Belaya on low health than it is to fight Wolf on low health. If I can kill him with this one rage, that'd be brilliant. There is going to be a cinematic, though, when I beat Wolf. Oh, I'm gonna blow myself up! Oh, I forgot that I have the freaking Panzer Shrek out! I may have Wolf. I did it. Ugh. Holy shit, I got a quick save. Right. I'm just trying to assess the situation here. Let's grab all the guns I can. 
He's still not very big at all. Now, I think I may get it. It's just all about killing Belia now. And then we've done it. Oh, good lord. Yeah, I'm happy because... Hey, what? Where was there a... I'm not sure, maybe... I, I, I'm just going to ignore that, because I'm pretty sure there is no... There's no one to feed on here. I don't see why I can't just feed on freaking wolf. Right. I may have this. See, Belaya is really not that difficult. To be honest, he's actually easier to fight the bigger he gets, because obviously the bigger the heart is and the easier a target is. But of course, the bigger he gets means the less places to hide there are. Alright. Now let's take that counter first. We may have this. I feel that he may start charging up faster now that Wolf is dead. I really wish I could record them cinematics, but it just fraps will just not work during them. So I'll just have to link videos to the cinematics. And I'm pretty sure I can find them. In fact, I am certain I can find them. I found them whilst looking for that other cinematic, and I had, in like, what, part 9 was it? I'm not sure. Are you glitched? I may have just unglitched him. Is that hitting? I don't know if that's hitting. I think he's trapped himself behind a pillar. Help me! However, he's in a bit of an awkward position. Man. Don't do this to me. Could just grenade. That again. In terms of guns, running around. I'm not even sure if I can hit his heart with them. Another grenade, very nice. I don't know if they respawn. I really hope the guns respawn. Otherwise, that is just a bastard move. Oh, he's so nearly dead. Can I just squeeze past? Nope, there's a Luger pistol. Can I just kill him with a pistol? That would be brilliant. Yeah, I think he's a little bit stuck. Oh, another grenade. Surely the grenades are respawning. Yeah, there's definitely guns up here. Alright, I've got enough guns now to kill him, definitely. Let's just throw that. Oh, I just... I should just spray at him, really. Surely something's gonna hit. It's that lamppost thing. You can just get around here. I feel a bit bad, but whatever. This game's kinda cheap. Is that not hitting him? Come on! Will another grenade respawn? Come on, give me another grenade. Give me a pistol. So I don't want to waste all my ammo. I can't even see where his heart is. Is. 
Oh. This sucks, come on. I think you may be. Oh, what? Gosh, you put it there. Glad that didn't hit me. Oh, come on. I have so got this. Let's get some distance. I have so got him. Unless he freaking does something now. Yeah! And there we go. So yeah, that was the end. Uh, you kind of have to leave uh, the ending up to your imagination a little bit. Of course, it's a bit of a... It's a cheap game, really. It's not massively amazing, but it's a game that I've known for a long time, and I just love it, mainly because of the extensive gore in this game and how much you can chop people up. But it's it's a fun little game, you know. Usually, sometimes the horrendously stupid kind of games are the best. And this one, although I'm not saying it's stupid, it's it, it's kind of silly. But I love it. This is definitely one of the games I'll never forget. So yeah, that was uh, Let's Play Blood Rain. I'm thinking I might do Blood Rain 2, but I much prefer the first game. Blood Rain 2 is more about combos and remembering like specific ways to attack. It is definitely more gory, in a way. It's sort so more realistic gore, sort of. Kind of. Sort of, kind of. I might do Blood Rain 2. Maybe I will. I most probably will in the end. But, uh, yeah. That was Blood Rain. I hope you enjoyed it. Because I did. I ended up playing it again. And I, I am sorry that I couldn't get them. Actually, I don't know. I, I could just be talking stupid, because there is a chance that I may... I've already found a way, like time travel, I know. I may have found a way to record them and I may have gone back and recorded them, who knows. But, um, I don't know. If they weren't in there, I'm sorry I couldn't get the cinematics and sorry I had to link it to another video. Uh, otherwise, I hope you enjoyed the cinematics as well. I don't know. Time travel, it's a bit awkward on my brain. But yeah, that was Let's Play Blood Rain. Thanks for watching ever so much. Like the videos, subscribe if you haven't, and comment because it makes me feel good about myself. But let's not sit through all of the credits. So once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next Let's Play. Good night.